I even forget my real surname. <laughs> Hey guys, my name is Lilin and welcome to another video! Oh, man. oh my god, he's just stealing my pickup line! What the hey guys, what's up? Lilin is back with another video and today we're going to talk a little bit about how I got my Chinese name. So, without further ado, let's get started! <laughs> so, how did I get my Chinese name? But well, I also have a Chinese name. Can I join you? What do you please. think, guys? I just want to join here, please. Can okay, I well, I'm oh. going to come and sit down. <laughs> hey, guys, my name is Wadamaya, okay? My name is Wadamaya, not Lilin, okay? She's Lilin. <laughs> He's just such a big fan of me that he okay. wanted to play along. But yeah. uh, we actually do a collaboration here in Beijing because he just arrived and you know that I'm in Beijing. So why yeah. not get together? Because we're all we friends. Just, yeah, that's Lily. <laughs> I love her so much because she loves China a lot. I don't know, like, why do you love China so much? Um, because it's an adventure every single day and you always learn something new. Okay, so let's yeah. begin. How we got our Chinese names? Yes. Okay. Start yes. with you. Okay, so basically I came to China the first time in 2011 and I was with this program and if you can hear the clicking in the back, it's uh, we got a new photographer friend. No, we didn't. <laughs> a tourist. Um, 2011, an agency sent me here and they had some Chinese volunteers. They asked if we wanted our Chinese name. I said, yeah, of course. Um, so they gave me a sound name. My name is Lei Na and they gave me a Chinese name for Ling Na, the one I still have. When I started writing the Chinese name, I did not understand that it was two characters separately I basically just wrote every single part alone and now we got an audience of 10 people I think <laughs> <laughs> but we, we, we're still gonna shoot okay that is why we are here okay so for Keep me going. how I got my Chinese name my surname is Akon Akon Ghana that's that's a Ghanaian surname all right oh, okay. my name is Akon so when I came to China they were like oh your name is Akon we can give you a Chinese name from your surname so they gave me a Kun, a kun in Chinese is like kun ge. That is elder brother. Oh, really? Elder oh. brother. So, like, <laughs> my Chinese name is just like my surname, okay? That's all. How cool is that? I didn't have a surname, so I actually, two years later, kind of made up my own surname based on my middle name, which starts with L. So, I just found a very common Chinese surname called Li. So, it turned into Li Ling Na, and now it's me. How beautiful! And I want to steal that name. My name is Lily. Okay. <laughs> Such a fan Okay, name. yeah, I love her so much. Okay. So, uh, oh my God, so much yes. audience here. Yeah. Um, so I have a question for you. Okay. Do you feel like you can relate to your Chinese name? Like, do you use it? Do you feel like that's you? Um, for now I can relate because I've been using the name for the past four years. So even though like my surname is that's Akun, but I even forget my real surname. <laughs> I, I went to Ghana. My father was asking me what's your name. I was like. Akun, but I forget that that's my Chinese name. That's, <laughs> <laughs> that's not my real name. A big difference, though. Like yeah, but it, there's no big difference though. One is like A K U N. Mm. That's the Chinese, Chinese one. But the uh, English one is just A C K O N. Oh wow, okay, that's right? really long. So <laughs> it's just the uh, sound, the pronunciation that is quite oh. different. But I even yeah. forgot my real surname, and I was yeah. using the Chinese one. He's okay. getting all Chinese here. Yeah, but um. You can relate to your Chinese name. I relate a lot. Like I see how my roomie, she only uses her her normal name, and then she does have a Chinese name, but only for like the IE to be able to find us when we sign up for the dorm at school. But for me, I basically have a tendency to introduce myself as Lingling. Ling. You guys know that yeah. as well. Yeah, I just I love it so much that Lingling Ling is kind of part of my personality now. I think like yeah. the China passion, the personality Lingling Ling is just together Lin, one big happy family. Lin, 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 Lin. <laughs> Every yeah. time she's I hardly mentioned my Chinese name though. <laughs> but you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna ask you my last question. Maybe some people might be uh, saying that. Would I also get a Chinese name when I come oh, to China? Oh yeah. So yeah. we just ha they just have to know whether they also need a Chinese name when they get to China. Is it I compulsory think, or something? I think it's not compulsory, but I think you should definitely think about getting a Chinese name because it's pretty cool and Chinese people can write it and understand it and remember your name. Like my name is very easy to remember. You know, like I, I was, let me tell you that, let me tell you something. When I came to China, right? Mm -hmm. um, they, they wrote my name on my uh, on a sheet of paper. Like yeah. everywhere I go, I should show it to them. Uh, everywhere I go, they were like Akun, Akun, Akun. I was like, yeah. how did 
didn't know my name, you know. Because, they remember. Yeah, because yeah. of the Chinese character. So it's very important for you to get a Chinese yeah. name. The Chinese characters, because it's difficult for them with the letters, especially like the uh, the aunties here, the ones in charge of the dorm. If you go into university, it's a really good idea to have Chinese characters for your name because they cannot read the letters, or if they can, they cannot remember who you are. Oh. Um, but I would say when you're looking for a Chinese name, you can ask a Chinese friend, but also you can look online, search for Chinese name or common names so or something you think is it's easy for you to remember because it's not cool to have a but name please, you can't remember. Please don't go in for Lin Lin. Please don't go in for no, Lin Lin. No, no, no. That's okay, me. That's because me. that's her. Okay. No. <laughs> Don't so, go in for Lily. All right. So guys, that's everything from us right now. We're going to make a video for his channel as well. Yeah. So you should check it out. My name is Wadam. No, 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 no. My name is Lily, okay? Come on, no. What am I at? Okay. This here. Yeah. All right. He's Peace. dumb. <laughs> So, Ling Ling is back all on her own, but check out his channel, I'm gonna put a link below and I'm gonna put his name over here. I'm gonna put in a pretty picture of his pretty face as well. And I'll see you again very very soon, Ling Ling, see you and